Hello, welcome back to Rainbow Gaming. I'm Matt. I'm Chase. And welcome back to Harvest Moon. Friends of Mineral Town. I never remember the that part. <laughs> I, I, I only know it as Harvest Moon. Well, see, the thing is, is there's so many different Harvest Moons that you kind of gotta... Oh, I need the... Um, firstly, I need... Like I need a brain, is what I need. I would offer you mine, but mine's no better, so... I, uh... <laughs> Did you like the little meme I showed you about Pokemon? Yes. And I was like, here's a rat, now go, now go explore the world and everything. Give me the chicken. I need to hold the chicken. But you're holding the egg instead. I know. I already, I did the, I, I picked the chicken up and put her down. I pick things up and put them down. Yep. You knew that's exactly how. Right. Yeah, that's exactly. Yeah. No, I know. I'm well aware. So now. So now what are we doing? We have crops. We need to put it on. So, pretty much it's the same thing as uh, Stardew. Yeah, I believe we yep. said that last time in the last video. Yeah, very, very similar. Um, there's actually, do you want to go mining? You, you can, can go mining. You can go mining in this way. Yeah. It's not it's not anything like um Stardew Valley mining. It's actually a lot better. <laughs> better how? Cuz in Stardew Valley mining, you have to deal with um the monsters and stuff. Oh yeah, the little slime bees. Slime dudes, the um, the diglet things, the um, bugs. Huh? The bugs. Yeah, the bugs, the flies, the worms, the the everything, rock crabs. Can I say it? Hmm. The lions, the tigers, the bears. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Is that the deepest you can go? No. However, we don't have a lot of space in our rucksack, so I kind of gotta... Yeah. Actually, wait a minute, how much how much muns do we have? I, I, I have no idea. This is... Hang on, never... let me, let me, let me pop this shit I, in here. I've never been real good with money just for that. Me neither, but I'm actually pretty good about... You know. Okay, so that's not bad. Actually, let's go see. Because it's a Tuesday. Let's go see uh, how much the um, the next size up rough stack we get is. It's funny that it's actually Tuesday today. <laughs> the music's so cute and charming. Oh, fuck. What? <laughs> <laughs> What? The supermarket is closed on fucking Tuesdays. <laughs> well, <laughs> that was a short trip. Whoops. <laughs> like, well, that was a short trip. Kind of like how I was yesterday. I was like, what? That didn't take as long as mm -hmm. I thought. Oh, the weed. Hey. Uh, hey. Uh. Oh, did you want to see, um, did you want to see what happens when you turn blue? Sure. He ain't turning blue. Give it a minute. What is it? Hey, that's starting to get tired. Yeah.
Actually, wait a minute. I think I have. Yeah, we have this. If you go digging around on your farm, you can actually find, like, random bits of gold. What the hell did he just do? You know how, uh... Sometimes when people get exhausted, they go, huh, and they're like, that's, that's pretty much what that is. Oops. I'm so tired, I gotta sit. So is he about to die? No. Any done? There you go, there he's blue. I so, don't think it's possible to actually, like, die. Have you tried it? No. There is one Harvest Moon, and I can't remember which one it is. Um, but, and I think I actually, I think I talked about this. There is a Harvest Moon where you have something akin to the, um, like, Sturdy Valley's Luau, where you have to bring, like, something for, like, a giant communal pot of soup where everybody brings something. Mm -hmm. and you can bring a mushroom and put a mushroom into this big communal pot of soup, and everybody dies. It's like Jonestown. It's horrific. <laughs> it's like an instant game over. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> you know, you, right? Have you, have you done that? No. I don't think I've had the, um, the Harvest Moon where that happens. And hey, what game is this? What? That you're able to do this? The, the poison mushroom in the pot of soup? Yeah. It's a Harvest Moon game. What the hell? It's, it's one of these. Why would you make that adoption? I don't know! Jesus Christ! Man. I, oh, the game is boring, let me just destroy the whole stuff. <laughs> let me jones down this shit. Oh my- no, <laughs> you know what my worst- what I absolutely fucking hate is a game over in a, in a game? What? Is if you're playing Harvest Moon and Wonderful Life, okay. and that one's on the GameCube, it's actually one of the ones that I have on my GameCube. Um... If you don't get married within your first year, mm -hmm. it's an automatic game over. Like, that's the whole point of the game, is to get married. Seriously? Yeah. The whole point of the game is to get married. Yep. I mean, the, the, you have to, you know, take care of your farm and have enough to live on. And actually, if you get married, and you don't take care of the farm, uh, your wife gets pissed off, and if you just don't give a shit about the farm at all, eventually she leaves, and you get divorced. Why she just- I... she- she takes the kid, picks up, and leaves. Why do I find that entertaining? It's kind of funny. It kind of is. <laughs> it's one of those things where it's like, why is this in a game? Right. Okay. So what are you gonna play here? Huh? So what are you going to plant here? I'm not. Are you just digging for gold? Yeah. Which I'm kind of surprised that I haven't found any yet. Anyways. Actually, it's Wednesday, so we should probably go see actually how much months do we have. I love how if you're holding down the run button, mm -hmm. You don't actually have to like hold down the joystick to go in a direction. You just you just go. Are we sure it's open this time? Yes. Sorry, but you don't have enough gold. Three thousand. Okay. That's bullshit. And it's five thousand. That's okay. Highway robbery is what it is. It is. Yeah. $5,000 for a damn basket. Why don't I just leave? Baskets are actually really useful, though. Oh, no, I don't I don't doubt that they're, that they're useful. I love how you don't even know what it does. You're like, yeah, it's useful. <laughs> well, that, I'm just going off of what I know in real life. Like, you know, baskets are useful sure, in real life. Let's see. Well, what can you use the baskets for in this game? 
Uh, in this game, if you bring a basket with you wherever you go, it'll hold 30 items, and then you can just tip the basket into the shipping box. Right. And it just immediately deposits all 30 items into the shipping box. It's really, really... It's, it's incredibly useful. Well, then why are your footprints in the sand blue? Like, is the water I coming don't in? Know. I think just because it didn't want to use black, because it was, uh, it would, like, be too much of a contrast. Mm. Hi. Hello. Who the fuck are you? It's Potpourri. Oh. Oh, okay, now I remember. Hello, Zach. Hello, Rain. Potpourri, have the packages arrived? You mean this? Oh, the... Nope. What? The jokes I want to make with packages. <laughs> Not those ones. Not those ones. That's the sad part. You just don't tell my mother. <laughs> really? What the fuck are you ordering? On the dark side of Amazon, did you? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, it's you a ordered. present for your mother. Oh. Oh, definitely from oh, Spencer's. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> Why would you say that? It's definitely no Spencer's. <laughs> what is it? Can you keep it a secret? Of course! <laughs> Just try not to tell anyone, though. My mom's birthday is coming up soon. I didn't want her to know I'm buying this so I used to mail order. Well, I yeah, I, I know. I said I wouldn't tell anyone. Yeah. You, you didn't even tell me what it is! Right, so how the hell are you not supposed to tell anyone? Yes, it is a mess. Just take that one. Let's steal from one. Why not? It's a boat. <laughs> it is a boat. Why? Cool. When do you get the, um... The fucking, uh... Fishing rod. I wanna go fishing. I like the fishing in this game. I like the fishing in this game. It's actually quite nice. Although, I will say, Stardew Valley fishing is a lot easier with the controller. Have you tried fishing in Harvest Moon with this controller yet, or no? It's... No, not yet, but it's not... It's not like Stardew Valley fishing. As a, like just the mechanism. The mechanism yeah. Are yeah. So in Stardew Valley, um, it's that you have to hold down the, the meter and everything. Right. You have, to, you have to cast your line. You have to hold down the the uh, meter. For this one, um, all you really have to do is um, so you'll cast out your line. You'll get an exclamation point in a in a chat bubble, and then you have to hit the the button, and that's it. There's no reeling it in, there's no meter to hold on to, there's, it's a lot easier. Yeah, in other words, here, here you go. Yep. Yeah, I got that song stuck in my head. Mm -hmm. Gone fishing. Oh. <laughs> With, uh, Louis and Armstrong is in it, and I think it's Dean Martin that sings with him. I'm most likely r I'm probably wrong. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna look that up real quick, if that's okay. Yeah. I just realized I haven't played the timer at all. That happens. Oh well. Extra time to play. No, that's not what I want. Alright, Louis Armstrong, Gone Fishing. Alright, so let me see, who did he sing this with? No, it was Bing, it was Bing Crosby. I love Bing Crosby. And they said that they did this with a friendship based on mutual admiration. Yeah, so Gone Fishing was... was uh, it was part of a... I remember that... 
my mom had an album of Louis Armstrong's music, and that was one of the songs. So, that's why I loved it. Sorry. Mm. Okay. I have no idea how long we've been playing this game. I don't know. Been a little bit. Oh well. Chichen. 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 Excuse me. No. There's no excuse for you. Actually, there is. I have written reports for it. <laughs> I have written excuses. I'm just insane. I'm not even gonna say what that looks like for a second. What? Want some ganja mugs? <laughs> could you imagine the harvest moon if that was the crop that you could grow? Why can't I jump over the. Why? Okay. The headphone is not staying in. That happens. Yeah. So we may not letting you jump in the middle? Uh, yeah. Weird, but okay. Keep walking, but you won't look on the wall. Keep walking, <laughs> but it isn't going to fall. You, you never watch. Did you ever watch Veggie Tales as a kid? What is it? Veggie Tales? Uh, no, actually, I didn't. What? I've seen like clips here and there, but I haven't actually really sat down and watched it. When you went to church, they didn't. They didn't play that for you? No. God, my church did. Broccoli, celery, gotta be vegetables. <laughs> yes, I still remember the intro. That's cute. It's sad as what it is. It's cute though. You're cute. It was a, it was a, good, it was a good little show, you know I, mean? I wonder if I can throw him in the water. <laughs> So, I proved someone wrong because we were talking, I don't know how this concept came up, but, you know, like, like, we talked about, like, you know, there was, like, the Bible channel or whatever, you know, like, the Christian television network. Mm hmm And I told them, I said, you know, I remember that at one time there was actually a Christian anime. And they're like, no, there wasn't. And I'm like, what? yeah, yeah, it was a Christian anime called Superbook. And what it was is that these kids had this magical Bible and they would get pulled into the world of the stories in the Bible. And like they had like this like travel house or whatever that like, you know, had all the computer stuff and everything to help them like with their adventures and stuff. That just sounds traumatic though. It I actually looked it up and I showed him. I showed one of the guys I was talking about, I was like, no, here it is, and I showed them the intro to it, and they're like, what? <laughs> so I was like, yeah, I was the, like, that was an actual legit show. Of the concept of being pulled into different Bible s stories, it just sounds traumatic, though. Maybe it's because, like, the ones that I'm thinking of are just horrific. <laughs> what stories are you thinking of? Uh... Blood, Sodom and Gomorrah came from you. And I, I was always told the worst of humanity with the Bible. It was horrific. There was this one movie called He Never Died and it actually deals with Cain. Like he's immortal. Yeah, you've shown me clips. I like how he, like he, like the woman, like there's one scene where this woman is like, you know, like after he like beats the hell out of all these thugs. She opens up his trunk and he has stuff from like the medieval times, World War One. He goes, that was in Fran that was 1914 in France. The language had changed, plus it had been a while since I used it. And she goes, is that you? And he goes, yes. Like, he's just flat out honest, like, yes. This right here, this is you. Yeah. I don't believe that. Okay. I, I, <laughs> he's just I like, okay. I kind of want to watch it. I like how, though, like, at the end, like, when she's like, how old are you? And he goes, I have no idea. Or like she asked him a question, she goes, that doesn't make any sense. He goes, didn't say it would. <laughs> but I like how he says it and goes, she's like, how old are you? And he goes, I have no idea. But I'm in the Bible, that means anything. And she's like, what? And he goes, oh, sorry. No, it's not you. I... 
<laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ! Good lord! I was waiting for there to now be a, a, a thing where I needed to hit the A button, but she just kept going. So she's a chatterbox. Yep. But, um, I like how he says it, he goes, You know, I'm in the Bible that means anything, so he goes, What? He goes, It's pronounced Cayenne, but I'm known as Cain. So he says, He goes, But I'm known as Cain. And he goes, I'm gonna go do what I need to do. What you need is right there. And she's like, You're just gonna let me leave? And he goes, I don't see why not. You're never gonna see me again. And just walks off. <laughs> just the way he walked off. No, but I don't think I don't think Sodom and Gomorrah were in the show now that I think about it. I know that like the story of oh. Joseph and the Coat of Many Colors was in it. David and Goliath was in it. I you know, there was a lot of like different, different uh Moses and the Burning Bush was in it. But that's all that I can remember. There's just, there's so many stories in the Bible where that could go so wrong, so quickly. You know? Yeah, I know. See, what I like is that, um, one of my shows that, one of the ones that I watched clips of and everything was, um, Grey's Anatomy, and I showed you that one. Where... Yeah, 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 yeah. You can't play the gay way, and I'm like, that yes. actually works considering the situation, you know, currently. But I like how she, the doctor, you know, the dad, like, the dad tries to, like, use the Bible and everything against her. And she's like, don't quote the Bible to me. And the priest is like, hold on, this is not what we agreed to. Like, the <laughs> priest is like, wait a second, hold on, this is not what we agreed to. And then she spits out all these quotes back at him. It just backfires, but I do like the message that shows that, like, you know, she's still, yes, she's gay, but she's still, you know, she's still uh, Christian in a way, mm -hmm. you know, or she's still Christian, that is, that is the message, but I like how the dad comes around and, you know, finally, like, says, like, he's understood and he still loves her and everything, he goes, he goes, does, he, first thing he asks her, he goes, does she treat you right, like the girlfriend? And she says, she says yes, and he goes, does she, does she make you happy? Mm -hmm. And she says, yes, that she makes me very happy. And he goes, I would like to meet her sometime. And he goes, but she's not a vegetarian, is she? Because if she is, I have to cross the line somewhere. <laughs> Just because she's, he's from, she's from a, a Latino family, you know, the meat is like a little right. farther dish. But I like that he goes, she's not a vegetarian, is she? Because I have to draw the line somewhere. <laughs> well, look on the bright side, at least you don't have to... Why did that remind me of Super Mario World? I don't know, but we have to... Oh, that's why, because in Super Mario 2, I've shown you it, right? I... Like, you can act, like, you don't have fireballs or anything, like, you're picking up stuff and throwing them at people. I think so. I, personally, it's not one of my favorite... Um, let me rephrase. I like the game, but it's not the one that I go to all the time. Mm-hmm. Because there's no fireballs, there's no star. Well, there no, there are stars, but there's none of the other power-ups. You know what I mean? You can right. choose your characters to play Mario, Luigi, Toad, Skull, Peach. Mm -hmm. But it's just not the same. It is such a pain. My friend uh, Nikki, she's actually um, she's doing a Super Mario RPG on her uh, Twitch streams. Oh my god, I remember that one. I feel bad, because I'd really, really like to be able to, like, sit and watch them, but she streams so late, because she's on the West Coast, so it's not late for her, but it's, like, late for us. Right. <laughs> like, I, I can't stay up. <laughs> I, I can't stay up and watch this. I want to, because she's amazing. I... We've known each other for years. Actually, next year it'll be like 10 years that we've known each other. It's, it's been a hell of a long time. And this is probably a stupid question, but could you go back and watch like past streams of it or not? I, I don't know. 
it's worth looking into. Yeah, I'll probably do that later. Mm. But, um... You guys are warm and comfy right now. <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna lie. I'm throwing on the top of it. I like the little stance he does, like, hey! <laughs> when he was fixing the items. Oh, that? Yes. The A. Actually... You gotta get more, um... I'm just trying to see if... It's... Cause it's not doing the thing. It's, it's not, not bringing up they... any goal. <laughs> it's frustrating. Boys. There we go. Fine. Are you happy now? Yes. We have enough. We can go get a bigger rock set. I'm gonna go get a big rock sack. You wanna get a bigger sack, huh? Yes. <laughs> yes, I am. Does it come with batteries? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to go. Oh, there. God. He's not gonna help you in this one. So. There we go. More space! Yay! And there was much rejoicing. Yay! <laughs> 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 I am so sad that the Game Grumps Live is not going to be in the US. Because mm. I've been to their live show, and I, when they came, it was like seven years ago, I think. I, I, it was quite a long time ago. Like, right when I got out. Yeah, it's been seven years. It was, yeah. And um, I went, and they were amazing. They were hilarious. It, but it was such an amazing experience to see them live. I would so want to go again. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's <laughs> Should I start singing the song too? No. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Oh, I think there was a request. What do you say, folks? Was that I'm a request? I'm gonna tickle you. I swear to God, I will. But you do that anyway. Not all the time. No, not all the time. I'm just saying you tickle me anyway, so... Yeah. How's that a threat? No response? Make it unbearable. The tickles from you are magical. So how's that unbearable? Oh. oh, what did you do? I did too much. Now I'm just gonna pull the weeds. Now you're just gonna pull the weeds. I'm pull the weeds. The sweet. Oh, hush. Can I help you? Yes. Jen. How? I love me forever. That, that was the plan anyways. Mm. Okay, so we found some gold, so that helps. Yeah. What the hell? I don't know. I don't know either. That sounds weird. What you need is like a hammer or something like that strong enough to get rid of those rocks. Well, let's see, that's the thing. Your hammer can't crush the stone unless it's level 3 or higher. Well, what level is your... You can't crush it. It's unless it's level 2 or higher. Our hammer is a level 1. So, how do you, uh, how do you... How do you level them up? By using them. So... Whoop, that's I mean... So you don't, like, have to make them out of different materials or anything like in Stardew? Uh, you... C 
so the way this works is so this this particular gray that uh, is your starting out level mm -hmm. um, once you've used uh, a tool enough um, it fills up with the gray first and then it goes to this like bluish silver and then gold and then um, I forget what the last color is because I've only gotten to a, a gold um, watering can. But see how it's got this chunk right here? Mm -hmm. If I go mining, I can take a chunk of copper and go to Saibara and have him upgrade this tool. Oh. Or I can wait until it fills up with silver and it'll give me a silver chunk and I can take a piece of silver. And go upgrade it immediately to the silver. Um, but like the more you use a tool, the more experience you get with it, and then you can level it up to a better material. That makes more sense. I'm just pulling leads. Sometimes, not. sometimes little things like that can be very entertaining, and that's probably what the, that's probably what it is. I think part of it is the sound too. I really like the, the sound. The sound. Yeah. The sound. The yeah. little noise that happens yeah. when you pick it up. Yeah. That. Oh, uh, yeah. that I can see. Well, if you want, if you want to harvest, if you want to plant more crops, you got plenty of spaces to do it now. Yeah. <laughs> kind of went a little overboard, didn't you? There is no such thing as overboard. Only underboard. <laughs> there, is, there is no there is no Dana only Zor. I get Every time I see that that's all every time I see the character that's all I can think of. We get for all the oh, cool. That's good. Yeah, for all the turnips. And that goes into the other box. Hmm. As in, that's also picked up by Zach. Yep. Yeah, all of the shipping boxes—they all go to the same thing. It's Actually. just for convenience' sake. So there's one in the um. In the barn, too. Okay. You need to get more seeds. But... Just couldn't let go. Because I can. I was about to say, you just couldn't let go. Nope. You? A CD moment? Yes. Then all of them start filling in one by one. <laughs> Gonna do and actually, this is what I'm doing. What are you doing? I'm going to firstly, I'm gonna cut up all the logs that are over here. This, this music is very relaxing, I'm not gonna lie. It is. It makes me want to close my eyes and just play you and just go, <laughs> you know what I mean? So I say, like, one more day and then we'll call it, or? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah, let's, let's do that. Let's make it one more day and then we'll call it. Okay. Now, could you chop down the stumps too, or no? Yes, but it's like with the bigger rocks, I need a higher level. Um. Uh, 
that's not going to work for me. Why would you do that? Because I suck. Is this as deep as the lines go or no? Nope. It's like Stardew Valley and it has, I think, a hundred levels to the line. Nice. At least you found some gold. last one you just picked up looked like straight up shit. Oh, the one that I said we don't keep? Yeah. It's, um, junk ore. It doesn't do anything. And who are you? Karen. And Rick. Nice name. Have you heard from your dad? Yep. Not recently. How can you leave my mom like that? And the only reason he's away is to find a way to heal your mom. He's just trying to protect his family, you know? I guess you're right. You have to take care of things until he comes back, right? Yeah, I know. Then stop getting so depressed, let's head home. Okay. <laughs> They're related, right? Nope. Nope. So is she like his girlfriend or something? Other than kind of. So, um... There are, uh... Like, rivals, I guess you can call it. Um, where like, if you don't marry... Uh, someone they they go off with someone else. So if we don't marry Karen, she'll go off with Rick. Uh, okay. So who have you married in this series? I haven't actually. I um I haven't gotten as far to marry anybody. Really? Yeah. I'm amazed. I thought you would have told me, like, you know, in one file I, I married this person. No, else. um, actually, I didn't play, I don't think I had this for the actual, like, Game Boy. Um, and one file I had on my other laptop, the dinosaur. Mm hmm. Um, I got. Oh no, I got like. What do you mean something happened to your something file? Something happened to my file and it sent me back all the way to the beginning of summer. Oh my god. And I was pissed. Um, understandably so. And I didn't pick the game up again for months. And, uh. So my other file on this particular uh, laptop. So the file that we're using here is um, a save file two, and uh, I have um, another file where I've gotten to autumn, but I haven't I haven't married anybody yet. So this is only my third. This is only my third profile playing this game. 
Do you need your money? What up? Today was the today was Thanksgiving. Oh. It was Thanksgiving. Yeah, spring Thanksgiving, and I missed it. Whoops. <laughs> See, that's the thing I I dislike about um this game is that it doesn't really give you like heads up on um uh. Like events or holidays or anything. Right. Unless it's like, hey, do you want to put your chicken into the, like, fucking, um, cockfighting festival? <laughs> that's a real thing. That's a real thing. They have a chicken festival, that's what they call it, and it's it's just, it's cockfighting. Oh my god. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Was that our last day, or do you want to do... I think that was our last day. Alrighty. But, um... I really like this game. It's, like, it's really relaxing, it's nice, it's enjoyable. You know what I mean? Yeah. And got a lot of progress then. Especially showing me what happens when you turn blue. <laughs> I was waiting for it to happen. I needed you to see it. <laughs> but... Well, thank you guys so much for tuning in to this episode of... Um, Harvest Moon. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked it, please leave a comment in the comment section below. And also check out in the description our links to our other accounts, including TikTok, um, Twitter, and um, Instagram. And Twitch. We yeah. have a Twitch. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. So if you guys would like to check that out, feel, please feel free. Um, other than that, do you have anything you want to say? Not really, nope. No, I meant to ask, I do have Oh, you'd like to add. I'm sorry. I should have That's all right. You're good. But no, I uh, got nuts to add. So, again, thank you guys so much for tuning in, and uh, we hope you enjoyed this episode, and we'll see you in the next episode. See ya. Bye.